y'all welcome back so when we left off we were getting ready to pump the foundation walls a lot went into the preparation for the wall pump we pre-drilled all of our seal plates had all our anchor bolts installed so they would be wet set right after the wall was pumped we laid down a vapor barrier for 57 rock to be slung in the crawl space as to make it easier later down the road uh, when we start running our electrical in there and our water lines keep you out of the dirt and since we've had a lot of rain these past two weekends it's been nice to not be stomping in the mud everywhere um, after that was done my first goal was to get in there and set my columns so I had everything laid out I measured what each column needed to be and um, took them, had them cut and welded, returned back to the land, tap conned them all into the uh, pier footers that were poured, and began floor framing. We started with our two girders. Each girder um, is comprised of 20 tuba 12s that spans the 40 feet, the long walls. So all of our joists go perpendicular along the short walls. Uh, those girders were completed in a weekend, and uh, this past weekend I installed all the four joists, 16 inches on center, two by tens, and um, we are nearing getting close to putting a subfloor on this next weekend. We will be blocking, running the rim joist around the perimeter of the floor system. And uh, I would anticipate we'll be standing walls around late May, 1st of June. Yeah, so we are super excited. So stay tuned so you can see how that goes.